Alright. Obviously, Thrawn Warzone, but what I'm gonna be doing isn't. Oh, wait a minute. There's no solos. I forgot. Guess we'll just spectate some duos then. I'm gonna be spectating, clearly. But right now, I'm muted because I don't want Jack to hear me commentating. Jack's in the call with me right now. He's also muted because he's watching YouTube and his mic just lets a bunch of noise through. So it's pretty much until he's done watching YouTube, it's just gonna be me talking right now. Obviously, I'm gonna be spectating some duos. Obviously, I'm going to be spectating some duos, because there's no solos in the game right now. Uh, and I'm probably honestly just going to kind of small rant-ish type thing, talking about the game. Because right now, Warzone is just not in a great spot, plain and simple. Uh, and there's not really much to it other than that. It's not really... It stopped playing when Caldera came out for the longest time, because after Verdancer was gone, it just wasn't nearly as fun. They brought out a bunch of unbalanced guns to the game. They brought a map that's just absolutely atrociously awful. Like, Caldera is just so bad. And it, alongside that, it's just, it, it stopped being fun when everybody started playing like a just like a douchebag. Everybody just constantly spam swabs, just randomly slides 360, just does all that annoying stuff for absolutely no reason, just to make themselves look better at the game. Just to get outfired by a gun that does slightly more damage with a slightly higher fire rate, because that gun's stupid OP. Like the Owen gun, the type, they should not be as good as they are. Check your gear the PSH, and stuff like that, They shouldn't. it shouldn't be nearly as good as it is, but... Here we are, you know. And then we got a map that's just awful. I don't know. There's so many things about this game that just aren't good right now. And I know this video will be coming out, what? Tomorrow's Wednesday, right? Nope, today's Wednesday. It's past midnight. Wednesday, probably around noonish. And I'll probably put up another video with it reacting to the Modern Warfare 2 gameplay and stuff because that's obviously coming out. And, uh, I don't know, I have high hopes, because apparently, supposedly, they're going to be showing MW2 and Warzone 2 stuff. And I just, War I have higher hopes for Warzone 2. I really would like a good Warzone game back, because Verdansk was, it had its problems, but Verdansk was fun, at least. Caldera is not. Rebirth can be every once in a while. The only way to ever have fun in this game anymore is just screw around with friends. That's it. If you're just screwing around with some friends on on Warzone, it can be fun, but not even because of the game. That's mostly just because you're screwing around with your friends. Like even the bunch of people that play this game on YouTube as like a career or on Twitch stuff like that, they they don't enjoy it. I was just watching a video from Strafe where he was complaining about it. It's just. I honestly just. You can still fight, soldier. I've stopped enjoying this game. And I know spectating was an older thing. But, I mean, if it works, it works, you know? I may as well. But yeah, I don't know. This game is just. It's not as bad with cheaters anymore. Like, during Verdansk, the cheaters were just insane. That's not too bad anymore with that. Uh, I'm gonna try and kill this guy. Might as well, you know. I'm just gonna go up, let him kill me. I don't care anymore. He dip. Okay. What was that? My guy? I be ashamed of your accuracy anyway you got like you got two sides of the spectrum you got the people that are stupid sweaty and play the game like their life depends on it there's people on the other side of peak i don't know if they saw that or not and then you got people like that who i'm standing still and they missed more than half of their clip on me now there's probably like three squads here there's a squad that was on the other side of peak this one and the squad they're bounty on right under them uh i don't know 
Just, I know if I spectate, it'll be so much better. So I just, I genuinely, unless I'm playing with a full stack with, uh, with David, Jack, and Jared, the people I normally play with, then it's just not that fun. Oh, Obamacare's crap. Just got Panini gone. I wish Solo was in the game right now because I'd much rather watch one one person fight one on one rather than a two on two. It's not as fun this way, but it is what it is. Just gotta see how people play. I actually. Hold on. I unfull sprint the game, so it's not gonna look great on your end for a second. Oh, that's rough. He just got shot. He's using a ZRG and a Cooper. Gross. Oh, Warzone. Stat tracker. Oh, What's this guy's name? Mitch Rap. You want revenge? Get up. Mitch Rap. What are number 135789? Alright, here we go. Mitch Rap has 1.02, over 10,000, or almost 10,000 kills, 96 wins. Alright, what about his teammate? I'm trying to bring Warzone back up, but it, it fails to work. I would gladly show you later on, but... Obviously, I don't edit my videos. It's like one of the clear things I do. And face graphics, photographs, extreme borderless. I'll check around here. What if I like? Nah, I need to pause it. But then I can't. Okay. Well, this guy's name is. That's loud. What is it? Nelly3209 underscore? Nelly3209 underscore. Going over here. My boy Nelly. Right? Got that nice 0.83 KD. A little under 4,000 kills. 42 wins. Uh, let me just see my stats too, real quick. Come on, come on, come on. Hate this, hate this so much. I got a 1.25, a little over 3,200 and 11 wins. Has some good games sometimes, but, you know, it is what it is. It is what it is. I'm just going to show you guys some stats as we go through teams. We have a total of, what, four kills? Nelly probably has three, this guy has one. Yep, four kills total. Super Carbine, I think his other one was ZRG from Nelly. And it might not have been Nelly, it might have been Mitch. They're both using Coopers. This guy's using a three to six. I think the other was, yep, two and a half. Just wondering which one of them. I'm assuming Nelly is using the ZRG. Nope, he's using an HDR. <laughs> Means Mitch with a three to six times Cooper, yep, is using a ZRG. He was using, I think that was VM Ultra on it too. That's gross. You got a three to six times. You got a long range scope with a sniper secondary. I mean, I guess for a map like this, isn't awful, but you get in that close range fight, neither, they're losing very heavily. I don't know. A couple times recently, I've just decided to up and spectate Warzone rather than actually play it. Yep, the Ultra. And it's been a lot more fun. Awful shut. Awful shut. Awful shut. Needs to take a little bit more time to line up his shots. How's Nelly doing? At least Nelly hit the shot. Fine. The ZRG is supposed to have really good shots. Oh my god. Mitch is getting clapped. 
fact they didn't knock Mitch right there, that was me because that's where my game might go. They had Mitch down to one shot. And they shot so many bullets as he was jumping over. Didn't manage to hit one of them. Awful timing, Mitch. Awful timing. That's why you don't use heartbeats anymore. Heartbeats are less of a crutch now. Okay. Barry, you... I'm just a little bit. Oh my god, what is this lobby? Have I just not played Warzone and... I know, because we played Warzone yesterday. Should we play Warzone yesterday? But yesterday is the day before. There's no way I should be getting a lot of people who are just not this... Not great. To, like, this extent. Like, these people are just... Not hitting. I have hope for uh, Mitch and Nelly, though. I want Foreskin Barry McCackner to come back, though. Let him win the game. But yeah, just some general information about if you guys are new to the channel and all that. I upload every day, except for Sundays. Sundays, sometimes I will. It just kind of depends on what I want to do that day. Either I won't upload or I'll just upload whatever I want that day. I don't edit my videos. I just start rec hit record, start recording, and go about it. Just because I feel like watching some people, they cut out too much. And I don't want to cut out at all, just so you guys get the full overall experience. You know what's happening at, like, all the time. Stuff like that. It's not even because I'm late. I have plenty of time to edit. I just... I When I watch videos, I prefer it where they don't cut out so much. Because then you're just like, oh, hey, you're taking this game that could have potentially lasted 30 minutes and cutting it down to 10. Just so you can hit 10-minute footage and be get ads and stuff well. And I just, I don't want to do that. So I don't edit my videos, I don't cut anything out of my videos, I just press record. And then whatever I up- or whatever I get, I upload. Sometimes I won't use certain footage, maybe I'll upload it later on, I don't know. Like, for all I know, this might not even go up tomorrow. Depends on how this goes. But, beyond that, uh, I'm not streaming right now either. I'm going into college very soon, I just graduated high school, so I'm gonna go into college very soon. And when I get into college, I will probably start streaming. Because I'll obviously have my regular PC and my second PC for streaming. Not obviously, but I will. And I'll probably end up streaming on that. Headed this way. Maybe. I'm not completely sure as to what I want to do yet for that. But I think I'll end up streaming again. I'll use my second channel, uh, SolarMK1. It's not a, it might be a one, I don't remember, actually. But if you look up... It, my second channel should be in my description. Nice shots. Kind of iffy at first, but he was hitting them. Ooh, rip Nelly. Old blooded killer got him. But, uh, what I was saying was when I get into college, I might start streaming more. Probably, I, it's either going to be on Twitch, which is in my description, or on my second channel in my description. Uh, stuff like that. So I stopped streaming just so I could focus full time on making videos. And my views and stuff are going up. I've gotten like 13 subscribers in the last like two weeks or so, so that's pretty cool. Thanks to everybody that subscribed and used my videos too, by the way. But just some general information on the channel. Uh, my name is Memphis, Anyone by the way. You? Or Solar Machete, if that fits better. I feel so weird just talking to myself right now. I don't. I feel like nobody's really gonna see this. So I'm kind of just sitting here talking right now to myself. And it's it's throwing me off, I won't lie. I don't understand how people can do it daily. I like playing with friends. It's so much better, but Jack's watching YouTube right now. And Warzone is butt, so we're not actually going to play. We'll probably just spectate. I could convince him to probably come in and spectate with me and record. And I can make a video on one person's view. He can make a video on the other person who spectates you. But, uh, I don't know. Yeah, I cover the general information about the channel. And the streaming. Daily uploads. I have a specific schedule I stick to as well. It's like a... 
Monday and Thursday are multiplayer, Tuesday and Friday are solo or co-op, which right now I'm doing a Minecraft series for that, and then Wednesday and Saturday is a Battle Royale, and Sunday is just, I don't, or I don't upload, or I just do whatever I want. Uh, Get to the safe zone. I really just play anything, so if anyone's watching this and has any recommendations, just leave it down in the comments, see what I can do for it. Um... I also very fairly recently got sponsored by a company called W. If you think about G Fuel, there's the whole caffeine crashing from the caffeine and sugar and all that. W is just, right there. in a basic sense, similar to G Fuel, but it's got natural energy in it, so there's no crash. And I really, I have a really high caffeine tolerance. Right there. Just years of G Fuel and pre-workout and stuff like that. Forks doesn't work, so I had to delete it. Okay. I'm muted. Uh. I have a very high caffeine tolerance, and W still gives me some good energy boost, so... If anybody here watching this wants a good secondary, you don't want to keep taking so much caffeine, W is really good. Its flavors, in my opinion, are mostly... It's only five flavors right now, but from what I have seen so far, from what I've heard, from what I've tasted, W has some better flavors, in all fairness. I get actual energy from it, Helps me focus really well. And I mean, it's about the same price, G Fuel, in all reality, but you can use my code, which is Machete. I will pop that up on the screen right now. There you go. W.GG code Machete for 10% off. I highly recommend it. It's very good. Um, yeah. I'm trying to figure out what else I want to talk about because it's called Era. Nothing's happening. I don't know what's happening with this lobby, but it's really boring. Covered channel information. Already talked about how bad Warzone is, so there's really no point. Hopefully, I think I saw that they're giving information on Call of Duty tomorrow for MW2. Nice it might be the gameplay reveal, stuff like that. I might stream it just because, but I'm not entirely sure. So I don't know when it's happening. I think it said it's 1 p.m. ET, is what it, I saw. Uh, PT, PST, I don't know. Pacific, Pacific standard. Um, that's okay. You probably shouldn't have won that fight, but okay. That guy wasn't very good. Still spectating the same team. Really bored of this team. I kind of want them to die now. I won't lie. Uh, once I'm done recording this, I'll probably see if I can get Jack on. And spectate some with them it's be a lot more fun when i'm not talking to myself i really do want to start streaming when i get into college though but i would i would rather start streaming with a bigger viewer base off of youtube so i know there'd be people to interact with in the chat like in chat i think that'd be really great but uh, that'll be a couple months um I'm not sure what I want to do yet, though. Let's make sure cash here. I think. Oh, I thought he bought a UAV for a second. Really? Yeah. It's about, this has just been terribly boring to watch. It's still better than playing by like a thousand percent. Playing this game right now is just awful. You don't have vanguard guns leveled up you're screwed there's pretty much nothing good outside of vanguard guns coopers especially stupid for some reason right now it's not even the best i are it's like top five though i think from what i've seen the bar and the nz41 are like the two best ars right now and then the stg's up there with them Cooper's up there with them, and I don't think anybody's even used any of the other ARs, in all fairness. Those are the only ones you ever see. And M4 is definitely there, too. M4 is not too bad. But, yeah. I miss Verdansk days. I was rewatching some of my old videos the other day, and there were just some good... There was some pretty solid gameplay in there. I was kind of annoyed because I really wanted Verdansk back. Oh, 
shot in the back. Getting shot in the back. Getting shot in the back. Let's go, baby. We got downed. Watch Mitch. What's Mitch gonna do? He's gonna go for it. Oh, you ran up to a rock. Yes, 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 yes! Yes! More KDs to show. Okay, we're gonna hit a report so we can go over here and bring up this instead. Oh, okay. It's struggling. Okay. We're struggling in here. Alright. We've got this and this. Back. E. Caden A. E. Caden A. E. Okay. My boy Caden. As a 1.11 KD, 11,900 kills, 397 wins, and Atomic, who's good for Carbine. And then his teammate is Ox Beast Mode 50. Okay, that's the stupidest name I've ever heard. And mine's not great, but like, bro. Ox Beast Mode 50 XO. Uh, I'm gonna assume it's the one with numbers five five two four five two six five five two four five two. Yep, there we go. Ox mode here's got six kills currently. He has a one point eight nine KD, seventeen thousand seven hundred and twenty seven kills, and one hundred and thirty seven wins. <laughs> that's, that's a rough. That's a rough. One. It's, it's people like this that get me. Like they play the game just so much. They know everything like the back of their hand. And it just for people that don't play the map it, it ruins it. It ruins the whole experience. It doesn't help that skill base doesn't work either. Here I go. Like the other day we were playing with Jared he has a .45 KD. And the team we got second place to. No, we weren't playing with Jared. We were playing with. No, it was Jared. We weren't playing with Jack. It was me, David, Jared, and one of Jared's friends. And we got second place. I had like 15 kills, like 6,000 damage, something like that. In between David and Jared's friend, they had like 10 kills, 6,000 damage. Jared had like 137 damage. Which just goes to tell you, you know, the point four five KD is starting to hit. And we lost to it. I had the number 4 KD in that lobby. The team that we lost to, we got second place. Had the top 3 KDs in the lobby. At a 3.8, a 2.9, and like a 1.9. And I think that's ridiculous. I have a 1.25. The teammate... My teammates were Jared having a 0.45. David having a 1 even... And the friend having a 1.2. And we lost to somebody with a 3.8, a 2.9, and a 1.9. They didn't have a 4th for some reason. I don't know if their 4th died or what, but I, they didn't have a 4th there at that time. And I just, I think that's ridiculous. Like, I don't know if, I'm not entirely sure about Warzone. I don't keep up too much with Warzone. I mostly know about, like, Apex, stuff like that. But I'm 99% sure... Warzone is supposed to have a skill-based matchmaking system. That and it just doesn't work, just like Call of Duty multiplayer. Suki the cow. Suki the cow here is dead, but he has a 1.32 KD, a little under 10,000 kills, and 107 wins. I'm trying to see his teammate, but it's not enjoying itself. Nandol. Nando, number 469. Number 469, 7630. Alright, Nando has a .47 KD, 975 kills, and 15 wins. That just goes to show a lot. Man has more wins than me with a third of the, almost a fourth of the amount of kills and like a third of my KD. It's got to tell you a lot. I mean, I don't play the game much, so I really don't care. But it just, 
It's stuff like that that doesn't make sense to me. In all fairness, I do mess around a lot in the game. I definitely can't help. Anyway. Should probably just get better. No complaining about it. It is, it is what it is. Speeds through 21. I just say it right. Speed underscore stir 21. Number 662231. Well, died. Every time I gotta look up somebody's stats, I die. He had a 0.69 KD, uh, 7,300 kills, and 52 wins. But a 0.69 KD, I like it. I respect it. Post underscore pro underscore perk. Post underscore pro underscore perk. Post pro perk. Post pro perk has a 1.29, 7,000 kills, and 43 wins. I believe in him. He can win this. I think this will be it, because it's been a half hour long video alone. Because Warzone takes 20 years now that Caldera's here. Or I guess has been here. But it, it's just ridiculous. Aimbot Perry. I have to know what Aimbot Perry is. Only five remain. Finish this once and for all. Aimbot Perry. Aimbot Perry had a 1.83 KD, 11 wins, and 692 kills. 11 wins, 600 or a little under 700 kills, and a 1.83 KD. Little Mickey, the dude we're about to start spectating. Little. Oh, that's mine. Watch the Punisher. Number five nine three five one five zero. He has a nice little one point six six with a little under eleven thousand kills. And they won the match. I like to see that. Anyway, I'm gonna go to lobby real quick and show you guys something. Come on, please load. There we go. God, I hate NVIDIA so much. NVIDIA replays always pops up. I don't have to disable it. Probably in the people experience somewhere. But... Anyway, go ahead and shut everything off. W.G. I'm in the process of trying out all of the guns and seeing how they do. This is my sweat clef. This right here. Between the M30 Strife and the pistol grip that I used for speed, literally no difference. It's just some max movement, max... uh. Fire rate, STG, and it hits pretty hard. It's it's pretty solid, honestly. These make no difference. So if you ever just want to mess around, use a decent thing, right here. I might trade out acrobatic for vital. If you really want to do better, but use the pistol grip. It's not worth using strife angle. Or even if you want to, probably the M3 ready grip would be better. I'm not actually sure. But yeah, it's just something I wanted to show you. This very good class right here. That's about it, though. I just want to spectate, rant a little. So, yeah. You guys have a good day.